And as you can see, it's just some uh, little generic Rust-Oleum Crystal Clear enamel. Um, nothing fancy or spectacular. Um, you don't want a real thick coat for the first layer. Is you can go back to the second coat in about 10 minutes. Make sure you're overlapping. Make sure you're overlapping. Anyways, that being the first coat, it's not a huge, huge ordeal. And okay, we're uh, we're gonna go ahead and do the second coat and. And then that should actually be it. It's been about 10 minutes. Like I say, you don't want to do it too soon because you don't want it to run. You can go a little bit slower on your second run, but you still want to make sure you're overlapping. If you're not overlapping, then You'll get streaks in it. You don't want streaks. Although you can buff them out, but you kind of want to hope you don't have to buff. And that's why you want to have nice even coats. Say so you don't want to have to buff. Of course, you don't want to ruin your paint job either. Even if it's with rattle cam, you don't want to ruin it. So anyways, that's kind of, that's kind of the gist of it. Like I say, you can go a little slower on your second coat. Um, you can do a third coat if you want. I don't know if there's enough in here to do a third coat. It's kind of a short can. Um, and I can see that it's kind of running a little bit. Although it shouldn't go any further than that. Um, anyways, like I say, um, even if you do get spots where it looks like it's kind of rough, you can buff those out later. It's not a big, big deal. But you want to give it plenty of time to set and dry and, and cure up. You want to give it like a week or maybe two before you go buffing on this stuff because it is it is kind of cheap of course with about any clear coat you want to give it a couple of weeks before you um whenever it stops smelling like paint is usually when you can actually start wet sanding and buffing and, and doing all your finishing stuff um anyways so there you have it a little practice piece just for fun. That'll be all for this video. I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate my subscribers. Um, I always appreciate new subscribers. Um, anyways, this is a practice piece. Keep practicing. Um, I thank you guys for watching and I hope you have a spe spectacular day or night, whichever one it is for you.